Hey art friends, today I'm going to read a poem to you from the book The Butterfly Jar by Jeff Moss. And the poem is called The Butterfly Jar. The Butterfly Jar We had a jar with a butterfly. We opened the lid and it flew to the sky. And there are things inside my head waiting to be thought or said. Dreams and jokes and wonderings are locked inside like a butterfly jar. But then, when you are here with me, I can open the lid and set them free. So today we're gonna to be making a jar in honor of this poem, and let's see what you can put inside. So to make our butterfly jar, we need to know how to draw the jar. So I'm gonna start by showing you that and it's just a series of ovals and some curved lines and straight lines. So I'm gonna start at the top and I'm gonna make a very skinny oval, kind of like a hot dog. We call these ellipse and ellipse or ellipses. Um, and then two short vertical lines and then you're gonna match this bottom part of the ellipse to connect those two lines. I have to turn my paper it makes it easier for me to draw that ellipse so you can do that if that'll help you. And then we want our jar to be symmetrical so that means the same on both sides. So my jar is gonna come out a little bit and go down. So I'm gonna go out to the side on both sides. So it's the same on both sides or symmetrical. And then it's gonna go down and stop. I'll do the same thing on this side. And it's okay if it's not quite perfect. I kind of made it go in a little bit there and that's all right. But I do want them to end about the same spot. And then I'm gonna repeat the same curved line that's here and here all the way down here. Again, I'm turning my paper to make it easier for me to draw that curved line. And now I have my jar. So in the butterfly jar poem, it said, we opened the lid and it flew to the sky and the things and there are things inside my head waiting to be thought or said dreams and jokes and wanderings are locked inside like a butterfly jar so we're wanting to see what's in your head what you've got locked inside what are your dreams what are your jokes what are your wonderings is there a world inside of your head is there a dream there? Is there a joke? Whatever you feel like is that you want to draw inside this jar is maybe something that you're thinking of. Maybe something that you saw. It is your jar, so you get to decide what goes in it. For my jar, I'm thinking about some of the hikes that I've been on and I'm creating an outside world inside of my jar. I'm adding insects and what they might be doing and plants and I'm adding detail with stippling dots and lines to make my drawing more interesting. If you create a jar at home, please email me a picture. I'd love to see what you create.